What is good, everybody? Man, it's your boy Jay in the building. We're back again with another video. And today, I have a Jackson State commit from last year, honestly. Uh, John Chevy Butler um, out of Dallas, Texas. Now, he, he went to high school in Dallas, Texas. And then he played his Juco ball in California in Dan Enza College in California. Now... I've been told that he's a, actually a quiet kid. Uh, a few, you know, there was one particular person who hit me up on IG and asked if I heard of him. I said no. Like, I didn't even know that he actually committed. But apparently he committed sometime last year. So um, I didn't see him on the, on the red shirt roster at all. So I don't, I mean, uh, apparently he was already at Jackson State last year. So, um, but he plays outside linebacker in the end, um, and he apparently going to be active on the roster this coming season. So, oh man, look, Jackson State has a bunch of guys on out the out the linebacker in the end position. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to these highlights. Let's get it going. Let's go ahead and get started. Hmm. Man, I, I tell you, man, you know, Jackson State has a lot of linebackers coming in. A lot of linebackers slash DNs. It's going to be real interesting to see who takes the field. Oh, man. It's going to be real interesting to see who takes the field, for real. Okay. Yeah, somebody hit me up on IG, and, and, and they told me about him, and I'm like, I, oof, jeez. He blindsided him. And I was in practice too. Yeah, somebody told me about him. I'm like, look, I didn't even know he committed. I didn't even know, like, I'm, I'm like, yo, maybe I must have missed it. Good D. Okay. Where you at? Yeah, I, I wonder what um what Jackson State is gonna do with. All the talent on defense that they got. I wonder what, what they're gonna do with him. Mmm. <laughs> he grabbed both guys. That's crazy. Okay. He, he looked a little stiff when he ran on. I'm not gonna front. He looked a little stiff. Okay. Mmm. He played both. Hey, that high. Had a way to play the option. I like that. Okay, now he at, he at the middle backer. Okay. I ain't gonna lie, man. He he went in there pretty high. He went in there pretty high. But like I said, look, this is his high school. So we're gonna watch his Juco highlights as well. Okay. Hmm. Okay. And you make the tackle. Okay. I like that. Now, I've seen him put it in work on Twitter, so I can assure you that I'm sure that he's gotten better. I'm sure of that, for sure. Especially with him, you know, watching games from the sideline, you know, hearing him not being on the active roster, I'm sure that that, that he, he, he knows the defense. I just didn't see any practice highlights at all. So I don't know if he even practiced with the team. Mm, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. Coming off the edge. Mm. Okay. It's not a little burst around the edge. Off the edge. I'm saying, man, look. Uh, yo, Jackson State has a lot of guys on defense. A lot of guys on defense. And now, mm, like, like how y'all said that, you know, that that Jackson State probably has too many receivers and it's going to be hard for all the receivers on the team to see the field. I'm starting to feel like that about the, about the linebackers and defensive ends. Like, Jackson State has a lot of guys. 
a lot. Whoa. Ain't, ain't nobody block him at all. Mm. Yes, the running back didn't even try to block at all. He didn't even try to block. But yeah, man, look. I, man. I think... Probably like oh like all like in most of the Jackson State highlights that I've watched so far, the majority of them has been defensive ends and receivers. You watch a you know a running back here and there. Wait a minute, whoa, whoa, whoa. He played quarterback too? All right, now we are about to watch his college football, his college football highlights before heading to Jackson State. So let's go ahead and get it going. Let's go ahead and get it going. Let's see, let's, let's see what's happening here. Hmm. Okay. Go off the edge. Okay. Hmm. Okay, huh. like how you hold that edge. Where he at? Okay, outside. I want to go off the block. Okay. I wonder. It's gonna be real interesting to see where where they put him. I mean, because you know, for most of the highlights we watch, you seen him blitz off the edge, blitz up the middle. Haven't played DN. Mmm, good block. I, I like that. Good block. Good block. Okay. With a scrape. Mmm, okay. And with a scrape. Him cut off the edge. Mmm, okay. That would have played a read option. Okay. Let's see where he at. Outside. You got the block. Okay. Where he at? Outside. Okay. I want to stuff the hole. Okay. Come here. Come here. Okay. We like that. We like that. Where he at? Gotta watch this already. Okay. Go to block. A big tackle, okay. Mm, that would have come off the edge. I like that. That would have come off the edge. Come off the edge. Mm, that would have used your hands, okay. He almost got there. Okay, with a block. You like the same block, though. Where you at? Okay. The zone coverage. Okay. We like that. See where you at. Where you at? Where you at? Coming off the edge. Mm -hmm. Okay. He only got there. Mm. Oh, and he missed the tackle. Okay. I like that. I like that. Okay, all right, now, I'm not going to lie. Whew, Jackson State has a lot of guys on defense that he's going to, like, that they're going to have to account for. I'm sure that 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 linebacker in, in, in defensive line locker room in itself is super jam-packed. So, I'm real interested to see what Jackson State does with him. I really am. So, I can't wait to see it. You know, we'll see what happens, man. But, yeah, like. The linebacker room is packed full of talent. So I can't wait to see how it turns out.